Is there anyone here who does not understand Swedish? Okay. It was about 20 years ago when I built my first ice musical instrument on top of a mountain, and I tightened the strings, and I plucked on the wires, and I heard the sound coming out from inside the instrument. And I was so excited by what I heard that I put on my skis, I skied all the way down to the village, and I told them what had happened to me and how excited I was. They pretty much thought I was a kook. <laughs> well, on that day, I sort of had a dream, a vision of what could one day become. Welcome to my dream. The ice instrument is, is made of frozen water. We're made of melted water. And that physical connection opens the door for a spiritual connection. And for me, when I listen to an ice instrument, it, it, it just makes me happy. It's one thing to build an ice instrument, it's another thing to maintain it and use it throughout time. Uh, the ice is always sublimating away into the atmosphere. Players get up next to the instruments, you got hot bodies next to cold instruments and they're melting and uh, the audience walks in, suddenly the temperature rises because they're breathing. In that case, the, the strings on the stringed instruments begin to get softer and the tuning, the pitch goes down on stringed instruments. On the pipe instruments, for instance, the, the uh, Rolandophone, uh, the, the tubes in the xylophone and so on, uh, those begin to go up. So you've got the orchestra going in two different directions. It took me quite a while really to understand that, that, that all of the tuning and all the, the, just the complete disaster was because of the temperature fluctuation and that eventually led me to realizing that I need to build my own architecture that can ventilate the heat from the audience away from the orchestra and that's how we came to the the basic design of the concert hall that we have with the two domes uh, which accommodates for letting out the heat of the audience and and uh, keeping the instruments in a cool you know I, I think of magic really the definition for me of magic is unbelievable but happening and I think that in the long run is the, is the kaboom possibility for ice music uh, to really affect the world, the people of the world, uh, in, in this release of, of really joy when your disbelief dissolves. Without a song or dance, what are we so tonight. Have a lovely evening.